Michelle, welcome. Doug. Welcome to the program. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm fine. How are you? I'm wonderful. Michelle has decided to join us here on the TV program to show us a couple of exercises that you've done before and also to share her story. You have a very interesting and very inspirational story. Yes. And um, she's kind enough to share it with her. So as she's performing the exercise, I'm going to describe it so that you can repeat it in your workout program. And then in between sets, we're going to visit with Michelle and learn a little bit more about you. Okay. Okay. We're going to do a bench press on a Swiss ball with just one weight at a time. So let's roll on out, Michelle. There you go. And we bridge up so your butt's lifted. Okay, now let's do a bench press. We have the dumbbell down by her shoulder, and she's going to press it up. Let's do 15 reps, Michelle, 15 reps. Okay. On a Swiss ball, it makes her very unstable. So there's a lot of core muscles working here in order to keep her balanced. Also, because she's in this bridging position, a lot of the hamstring and glute muscles are working. So we're getting a lot more bang for the buck than just training the chest, which is where the bench press comes in. That's primarily pectoralis major along with your triceps and your deltoid give us this pressing motion. So she's going through a full range of motion all the way down to her shoulder, exhaling as she pushes up to full elbow extension. Is that it? Yes. Excellent job. Excellent job. And we'll talk a little bit more about that on her next set. Okay. Uh, let's slide up here a little bit closer okay. so you don't go off camera here. There you go. Now, Michelle. Um, you're here because you're overweight. Correct. And you also have um, a history of weight loss. Weight loss. Okay. Mm -hmm. That started as a young child or a teenager or? Very young. Very I've, young. I've been overweight as long as I can remember. Okay. Um, second grade on. Okay. Due to dietary, genetics, uh, I think it's a little sedentary bit of everything. lifestyle. Yeah. Okay. A little, a little bit of everything. Okay. So. Okay. And that went all through high school. Did you try to, as a younger person try to diet or yeah, exercise? Yeah, everything. Did you? Okay. <laughs> yes. Weight Watchers, everything. You name it, I tried okay. it. Well, except medication. I okay. Was, I did not ever try okay. uh, drugs as a means to lose weight. And you d didn't stick with it for a long enough time or you got Just discouraged? Just successful, yeah. It was one of those, it was, it was the roller coaster, you know. You, okay. Um, you lose some weight, then you gain twice back and you okay. lose some more and then you would gain it back and then some. Right. It was just up and down my whole life. Okay. So, uh, when the gastric bypass was something that my primary care physician was comfortable with and had he had some patients that had already gone through it, okay. he recommended it for me because it was a more permanent solution. Okay. And that was as an adult? Correct. Okay. Mm -hmm. That was in November 2001. Okay. Okay. Well, good. We need to hear some more about that. Let's do another set okay. though first. Let's do your other hand. Okay. And let's roll out a little bit here. There you go. And stop there. And we're doing her opposite hand and bunch press up. There you go. Exhale as you push up. Uh, normally we do one set on each uh, arm and that would be um, one set. And uh, be just because of time restraints here with the television program, she's doing one set on one arm then we're resting and doing the other. But normally again we do both arms. It's real important that she exhales as she pushes up. That is the exertion phase of this exercise. And when you exhale, you're preventing your, your blood pressure from going up. Very important. Um, you do not want to hold your breath while you're exercising. It causes very high blood pressure. So uh, Michelle's doing a great job there. We don't give her a lot of weight, okay? Um, more so because we don't want her to get all sweaty on the TV show. <laughs> but <laughs> but uh, Michelle comes in for our lunchtime program and that is a 30 minute workout that is very rapid. It includes cardio, total body workout and um, so she's pumping the iron and she's doing the cardio and, and you've been doing really well with that. You're, I really enjoy it too. That's good. <laughs> okay, so you went through gastric bypass. Correct. And how'd that go? Did really well. It was successful. I didn't have a lot of complications that some people have. Um, lost 180 pounds, lost a whole person. Wow. Um, I've had some weight gain, um, a total of 60 pounds weight gain, okay. but I'm still down 120, so, okay. you know, it is a, it's a good place to start, but, you know, before it gets out of hand, I wanted to okay. try to nip it in the bud. And So the battle, I mean, even after the surgery, you still have a battle ahead of you. It's not, everything's fixed and you can do whatever you right. want, it's, right? It's a tool. It's not an answer. Okay. You know, it's, it's still, you have to be careful about what you eat. You have to be careful how much you eat. You can out eat the surgery. You okay. can stretch out your stomach pouch. You can um, 
you can gain weight. You can reverse okay. the surgery, kind of. Okay. Um, so I, it's just a and tool. And you have to exercise, right? <laughs> yes. You still have to exercise. Yes, you do. You have to exercise. <laughs> okay. Now you've been going through some testing because there was a, some thought that maybe you did stretch out the pouch or what was going on yeah, there? Yeah, that's what we wanted to make sure that the weight gain wasn't from stretching the pouch out okay. or overeating. And that uh, we're finding out that that's not the case. So okay. um, that it's just uh, like 10% of the people have, have a complication and I might be one of those 10. And, okay. Uh, it, but it's an easier fix and hopefully we'll keep our fingers crossed. Right. Well, you're doing the right thing by exercising too. Oh, right. Absolutely. And then um, we've helped her with a little bit of a diet that you're sticking to. Yes. And you're seeing some positive results. It's like week by week, you know, <laughs> I'm down another size or, you know, yes. I can do this now. I didn't, I wasn't able to do this. And then things are easier. You're getting stronger. Right. You're, there's more muscle tone. You're noticing stuff in your arms and right. shoulders. Yeah. Right. My abs. Uh-huh. Yeah. Just in two months. That's, That's good. That's wonderful. That is wonderful. So. And, uh, but I, you know, she's accountable each day. We're asking her what's going on. How have you been doing? Um, yes. Stay focused over the weekend is, is common. <laughs> yeah. You know, so um, the, the accountability is, is something that helps a lot of people, and I'm sure it's helping you too. It so. is. Well, good deal. Thanks for being on the program oh, and thank sharing you. your story. Okay? Thank you very much. We'll have you back. We'll see you again. Less of you next time. Yes. Though, right? Let's hope. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. Thanks <laughs> thank again, you. Michelle. Give this a try. A bench press on a Swiss ball using one arm at a time to engage your core muscles.